Hello everyone, and welcome back to Field of Snow. That chicken is half naked. So I made the horn, because it said it had a strange effects near birds, right? I don't see the bird anymore. I think it just flew off. But, there might actually be a way... It broke. Fantastic. Oh, there it is. Hello. This is how we can kill it? Oh, that's how we get the feather. Sweet. So it was from the birds, we just needed an item for it. We need to honestly just waste items to get this one feather. Well, I guess. We don't really need a feather, but I guess we have it now. So I made a bunch of more healing potions. And I was thinking about increasing the size of our building at some point. You know, have it a lot more compact. Have a better storage situation, because now everything is just everywhere. But what are we going to be doing today, you might ask? Well, we're quite prepared. I would say we go and fight some mechanical things. Actually, before we do that, I want to get that uh, battle fairy as well. That seems like a smart plan. So, where is it, place? Well, not far from the Ironville, actually. So, we have to get their stuff back. And that's fine, we can easily do that, I suppose. I have been collecting all these things again, because I feel like eh, we're going to the point where we probably need to buy a bunch of stuff from the, some of the merchants, because those bombs we were not able to make otherwise. I'm not sure if that will change in the near future, but we needed them now. So that's why I did that, you know. That's why I bought a bunch of them, bought like 10 of them. I did make a little bit more money right now. So the thing that we're going to be doing today is I'll probably just do questing today. In the next episode, we're going on an adventure again towards that treasure chest. Because we haven't done that in a while as well. We haven't gotten one in a while either. This is the second one we actually gotten at all. And I want to see what it has. Cause I, f I don't remember actually what the last one had. So it probably didn't have any good stuff in it. Let's put it that way. It probably didn't have good stuff in it, because I don't remember. Okay, smart plan to do here, just, again, like always, knock them out. I don't know what the scrap's for. We might just be able to, you know, use all these things and sell them. But it might be for, like, a bigger quest later, or just for crafting recipes. But honestly, I have no clue, because they don't drop recipes anymore, meaning... Probably something else needs to drop it. Yeah, you thought so, eh? Got a confusion blow to the face. Also, don't need those anymore. I did sell a bunch of them. I want to kind of pick them off one by one, uh, if at all possible. It is nighttime right now. Damn. Let's just kind of slowly go through it. I don't know where exactly their stuff lies. The quest mark says over here, though. As I don't see any. I'll just wander around till we can find here. That looks like it. Or anyway, it looks like something anyway. We can pick it up. Yeah, we did it. Sweet. Let's see what else this place has. Isn't it like they're creating some sort of liquid? I don't know what type of liquid. It just looks like cooked water, to be honest. But I kind of doubt that that's it. I don't know. That's kind of it, though. Well, look how we raided this place. It went a lot easier than the goblin camp, but we are a lot more skilled by now. And dying isn't actually something that goes down as easy anymore. We don't die as often now. But yeah, we took the spare parts. We need to go to this village now. I just do that. Oh, it is kind of nighttime, which is kind of annoying, but we have to deal with that. Also, we got our five. Oh, we don't have it on us. We have five Eskimos now. We got six, actually. Got two in one night, which is pretty sweet. Uh, thank you for finally being able to bring back, repair everything. What do you Americans want? Uh, with all these spare parts. But anyway, I heard, I heard that in the main Mar uh, Markins camp, where uh, there were many boilers. It is likely that they will melt the metal to create weapons. Weapons. I have to move fast. So I don't have to take out the camp. 
and a marching camp to stop the production of weapons. But that's not even near the other camp. Anyway. Oh shit. Oh. Ha, you failed, Stan. You failed. Oh, sweet. We are so level up. So, yeah, let's go back to our place first. Which was in Snowville. Because I want to grab those Eskimos, because I want to use those right now as like main healing source. Because if we eat five, uh, I'll probably get an achievement. And I kind of want to get all of them. I found like that's pretty cool. So we're going to throw another one into this one. There's a pretty strong attack by now. But not strong enough for us. And I also keep grabbing all these lollipops, because, well... I wasn't able to make all of them into potions. And there's still like 10 bottles or something, but it doesn't really matter, I guess. Okay, we'll put those away. Let's make like a clear inventory again. Because I hate having my inventory cluttered with stuff. Okay, well, I do know we sold all of these. So yeah, there we go. Where did we put the Eskimos at? Ah, here they go. There we go. So yeah, this is all cluttered up, which is why I want to create, like, an extension onto our base. So we'll probably kind of go out like that. Then we have, like, a little crafting room. And we'll have a little storage room. And everything would be kind of nice. And then we'll have a separate bedroom. So we might actually tear down the entire place, pretty much. I don't think we can actually go this way. I have to go further this way. Okay, I might eventually end up tearing down the entire place. Or we might just end up building onto it. I don't know exactly yet. Uh, I do know there are fences, so I want to create like a proper garden. Probably have like lands, patches of land for each type of thing. I do know I sold all of her seeds, so I'm not that smart. But I did keep like the most important ones, which is the lollipop and the sweet seeds, which are the two things that we actually are growing right now. Those are kind of the only things I really want. I mean, we have a couple marshmallow bushes, but we don't really need it. So I got some of these eggs. I just slowly keep eating them because. I don't know, we don't really have a point for them. I hear you can cook them eventually, and they'll restore 50 hunger points, but let's face it, nothing really beats the cooked ham. I think it's very overpowered. I, I'm not gonna lie. These things are so easy to get that it's insane. You just go to this area, because I was over here for a while trying to get the skin, the hawk skin, and they dropped the meat as well, and that's how I got so much, and I keep beating onto those chickens, so... And they die so fast at this point, that we get like tons of meat. Like we get meat faster pretty much than it goes out uh, sometimes. We still have like 10 in here. We guess still got our snail soup. I've been selling all our snails though. So there's another thing. And I think we're just gonna go right now. I don't wanna waste a lot of time. Nighttime isn't as scary anymore as it used to be. We can easily take these guys on like, what if we two slices even, and those guys are dead. We need a ton more experience. I do kind of want to keep killing all of the things I find. Well, at least all these nightmares anyway. So let's see, go to Ironville. This is pretty much where we're going on. So we're going towards and stop their production right now. Yeah, that's... It's getting so easy to kill every single item me right now. It's kind of insane. Makes it kind of handy, too, though. And I don't want to spend, like, millions of uh, minutes on, like... Pretty much murdering all these things. I feel like that would be too boring. But this confusion blow makes it so much easier. And having a decently strong sword... You can easily slice through pretty much everything. Except the ranged ones, the ranged ones are kind of annoying. But everything that can, that will come close to us, you know. You see, like, they just practically run into our blade to get stunned. It's insane. Actually, these guys. I also think these give, like, the most amount of XP for right now. Yeah, I got, like, a decent amount. And with decent, I mean, like, 400 XP. Which is a lot. <laughs> Not gonna lie. So I actually just kill these guys off because they're easy. They're easy and they get tons of experience. Anyway, they look like the biggest guys around the block, so I assume these ones are the ones that give the most XP. Let's see how much this one gives. This gives us 400 as well. They might just give all 400. No, this one gives 200. There we go. 
I wasn't hitting him for a second there. Oh shit. Oh shit. This, yeah, we can easily block this guy as well. He goes all insane. There we go. So yeah, since we upgraded our shield quite a bit, I think we can still actually upgrade it by two, right? Yeah. We have pretty decently strong shields. They're pretty good. And this is where the main stuff's going on, pretty much. So, we need to find, like, where they're doing stuff. I think we'll probably be, like, in the middle here. We'll probably have to kill everyone off, don't we? So let's just get them all one by one. Howie. Hurrah, 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 hurrah. Yeah, no thanks, mate. Just kill this guy off. Do that, and actually we need to... Oh, that also gives us a speed boost, eh? I forgot about that, I read up on that. And I was like, oh, they're pretty cool, I guess. But yeah, the speed boost is actually quite uh, good, though. I don't know how much it will help us in here, but... There's a death marker there. Cool. He doesn't seem to be doing anything. Just like any other ranged guy, I suppose. Oh, fantastic. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh no, we just angered <laughs> all of them. <laughs> okay, well that didn't... I'm the Markin, Chief of all Markins. Tell me your name, Traveler, tell me. Why are you killing my brothers? My name won't tell you any anything. And your men are robbing the villages around. Why are you involved in this? You look like you're from far away lands. Well, it's actually like... What is it? A, a two minute walk? I mean, it's pretty far. I mean, I don't like walking for two minutes, but we have a teleporter, so... It doesn't matter. Because you're... Uh, you yeah, Because of you, Ironville's resting into pieces. Soon the village will be gone. You're killing all of them, or them all. I can't let you do this. No, the items is fair. It's not my fault. I'm not in no need of those hunks of metal that you're called spare parts. I take orders from the ancient machine. Otherwise, terrible death is the fate of all people. Let me go and I'll stop the ancient machine. You? <laughs> your fist. I'll never reach. Uh, your fist will never reach him. I defeated Ice Queen Nightness in the Cave of Ring, uh, Ring Wind. Hmm. I think there is no difference whether you die here or trying to kill the ancient machine. Well, if you destroy the sinister machine, so be it. I revoke my brothers. Ah, hey look, we get another heart. We rescued another civilian. And we also maxed out sword stuff. Except for the shield, you might want to do that too. After that, I think I'm going to go for magic. Find the ancient machine, where is it at? Holy shit. Oh, that's not that far. I'm like, oh god, it's in black again. <laughs> that's pretty much like the worst fears, right? Like, oh no, another black area. Because that usually means things are very far away. Well, let's actually go to the village right now. Because we rescued one of the new villagers. I just want to see which one, and since it isn't specifically showing me, I'm quite interested, actually, in which one it is. You know, in the meantime, just eat that. It really fills that as well, so that's pretty good. I don't want to get to deal with that guy. Where is our where is this village at? There we go. So, come on. Teleporter. There we go. Snowville. Who did we get? Let's see. No one? Or is it because we just didn't update the map yet? What well, isn't this one, that's for sure. Have we a guy down here? No. I'm pretty sure it's said that we rescued a villager, right? Maybe it's just a villager in another building, and maybe. Check out all the buildings. 
Okay, well, not the old man's building. Maybe he's just in the shop or something. I don't know. Well, we don't get him yet. I don't know. That was kind of weird. Oh, okay, well, he's not in here either. He's just randomly around somewhere? I don't know. See, this is kind of the problem. Like, we got this villager, right? But I have no clue on where he is right now. I'm going to be exploring the entire town. And it might be the one that's fishing. Because I remember there was, being, there was a fishing pond here. Nope. Not here either. There is... I think there's only one other actual area in this town where you could possibly hang out. But I'm gonna go like this really quickly too, just to be sure. That oh, doesn't seem like it. Oh, there is a little... Oh no, that's just a wall. I was gonna say, like, that's a little block height. There is this area. Yeah, there is. Here it is. La 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 la. La 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 la. She sounds beautiful. Wow. I mean, to me it sounded like a man, but that might be because I'm voicing everything over, but whatever. Okay, well... <laughs> that's that, I guess. <laughs> okay, well, we cannot do anything with her yet. I'm not sure if we ever will or not, if he's just a random character friend in there. I kind of like that. It kind of gives that extra feel to the village, I suppose. That's pretty cool. I hope we're going to be finding a lot more bosses like that. I wonder if the game's like actually done, since there's only like one more actual hidden achievement. And by right, for right now, like all the hidden achievements were boss fights, and all the boss fights gave us new people. But we still have three more buildings to go. So I'm kind of concerned about that. I'm quite concerned with that. Like we might not be able to actually get all these people yet. Anyway. So, I'm going to be leaving it out over here. Seems like we need to eat two more ice creams, but we'll do that some other time. Uh, so, next episode... I said that very weirdly, like I wasn't actually sure. Next episode, we're going to go to this axe and probably go over to this ancient machine. Check it out. And I might actually want to get this one on the way. Although, do we? Probably not. I wonder if that's... Find the ancient machine. Your goal is to find uh, the goal. The ancient machine is the one behind the production of the weapons. Find it and stop it. Yeah. I think that's a boss fight because you are kind of able to see the names of the achievements, and I think it was something with machine. So, yeah, this could become a very hard boss fight again. So we want to stock up on stuff. We have quite a decent amount of stuff, so we should be fine, honestly. And this is pretty high leveled now. I think we're pretty good. But anyway, hope you all enjoyed, and see you all next time. Bye, everyone.